Hi guys, how's it going? Some big news today as the personal data of over 500 million Facebook users has been posted online in a low level hacking forum. What does it mean for Oculus users? Let's find out. Hi guys, how's it going? So today, big news as Facebook's data has been leaked online by a low level hacking forum. This includes half a billion people's personal data. Now, here's what we know so far. According to various reports, the hacking occurred on Saturday, where more than half a billion users from Facebook's personal data was posted online for free in a low-level hacking forum. Now, the exposed data includes personal information from more than 106 countries. This includes over 32 million records on users in the US, 11 million on users in the UK, and 6 million users in India. Other countries that are affected by this leak include Afghanistan, Australia, Bangladesh, and Brazil. So far, it seems that the data that has been leaked doesn't include any data points recorded by Facebook by people who use the Oculus Quest. What we know so far is that the data that has been published includes Facebook IDs, full names, locations, birthdays, bios, and in some cases, email addresses. A credible publication called The Insider actually reviewed some of the sample data. After they reviewed the sample, they found that they actually verified several records by matching known Facebook users' phone numbers with the IDs listed in the dataset. They also verified records by testing email addresses from the dataset in Facebook's password reset feature, which can be used to partially reveal a user's phone number. Originally, the leak Facebook said occurred in 2019 when the data was being sold for as much as $20 per search via Telegram. Facebook have also added that back in 2019, they did a patch to solve the vulnerability. However, it's quite clear it's not that effective and also have yet to offer a public apology about this new leak. Now, of course, this is huge cause for concern as cyber criminals could potentially impersonate these people or even use the personal data to scam them. Now, currently, Facebook are being taken to court by many different countries all over the world for breaches in antitrust and anti-competitive laws. Let's not forget that Facebook now had the ability to record more than 2 million data points every 20 minutes of anyone who uses one of the Oculus Quest VR headsets. This includes any physical movements while using one of the apps, as well as outside of the VR headset, as now there are cameras available that can record inside of the rooms. Netflix have also released a couple of documentaries where they actually interviewed executives from Facebook who reveal how the data is being recorded by users. It has been revealed that Facebook can actually influence people's behavior by pooling as much data as possible from them when people are using one of the products. This includes behavior in society, for example, being able to rig governmental elections, as well as, of course, changing buying habits to lure more advertisers to their platform. As we mentioned, data from VR users have not yet been affected. However, this is also a huge cause for concern, as in the future, potentially this data could also be made public. And let's not forget that Facebook's platform Spark, which is dedicated to the augmented reality community, also owns a sub-license of any content that is posted to the platform without the express permission of the user. This means that anybody that uses their platform, Facebook can basically do whatever they want with any assets that are uploaded to it without any express permission required. Nor do they owe any money to any of the original content creators who would publish any such assets to the platform. Now, because we at VR Essentials do not believe that Facebook have the best of intentions, both for its private customers, but also for the growth of humanity, we actually, a couple months ago, did delete our WhatsApp and also Facebook account and would encourage you to think about it in potentially doing the same. 